Hey you guys, it's Michelle here. Thanks for joining me today and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna decorate my spread for next week, which is December 20th through the 26th, the week of Christmas. So I wanna make this one really fun. And this is also gonna be the last spread in my Wild Style Planner that I've been using for a solid year and a half because my new planner, even though there is a week for next week in here, uh, my new planner also has a week for next week, obviously, since it's the first on the on Saturday. And then what I want to use for this spread is these red, these are large Mambi stick letters from the Happy Planner. I'm going to use these red metallic letters to spell Mary across the middle. That's the only thing I have planned so far. I'm going to use those, spell out Mary, and then I do have the Christmas book and then my older Christmas Joy sticker book to decorate with. So let me just see how this is going to look. I want it to kind of be centered. I'm gonna I'm gonna put the E for, down first because I want it to be pretty close to the center. good. Okay, I think that's a pretty cute start. And I just had an idea instead of, which I still might use these two books that I pulled, but I wanna use some of these leaves and branches from layered florals. Oh, I already put them here in the front. I think these look so pretty and Christmassy. So let's see. I wanna kind of have them like, like coming out of the letters say like this would be good over here this scrap that I already had cut and then here's another one which could be good somewhere I'm going to do that one there and just trim off this little part I hope that I end up liking this because I don't know how the other stickers are going to pair with it, but we're going to see. So I'm going to put this right here in the R, like right there. Smaller pieces over here. these little ones like that to pair over here with this section. And I'm going to trim off anything that's um, above these lines, I think, like above the, these lines, and I want to keep it all in here. But for now, I'm going to set it just like that, and let's see what happens. So here's a couple of leaves that I'm going to cut apart. Actually, I think those are going to be a little too big to use on the word itself. I think I'll use those elsewhere. I'm going to go ahead and cut this and see what it's going to look like. I can always piece it back together if I don't like it. 
Oh, I like it. I think that's pretty. So I could use this here. I'm going to try this here and see what it looks like. Okay, now a little scrap here. I could do the bottom of this E. So let's do this one over here. Actually, I think I'll do it coming out of the E. Mm. I'm going to take this leaf off. it a little bit closer there. Okay, tiny scrap I could use. I'll use that right here on the inside of this R. Another one here that I could use on the inside of this R, uh, like the top part of it. Let's do that right here. And these little scraps that I cut off are perfect to use around the letters. Okay, that's one of those big leaves that I cut apart. It was a set of two. Let's get that little bit off of there and I have two more of those. And then I'm going to use this one over here. Okay, so let's do some of this. This was actually like a round wreath. I used all of these last Christmas and the one before to make like garland up the top. I'll find it, see if I can find a picture of one of the spreads I did like that and show it to you. But for this one, hmm. I'm going to have to cut this one apart because it was cut weird. I kind of like that there. What do we think? I 
think I need a little bit more of this stuff. this apart so I can do that the E needs something so let's do a little bit on the E like that and then we'll have this little piece kind of growing out of there I'm gonna cut this one apart Okay, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop with the leaves for a minute and look in the Christmas book here and see if there's anything I want to kind of mix in. What if I do some gifts in there too? Would that be cute? I think it would. I think I'm gonna pick this one up. Or wait. I could do, I'm do this little car. And scoop this one up here. Well, maybe I should have done this before I put down so many leaves, but it's okay. Put that over there. Okay, so I want something up here, like a box. I want one of these kind of full box things. Ooh, I like this one that says Merry Christmas. because it's got a little bit of greenery in it too. Okay, cute, I like that. And then I think I'm gonna fill in the sidebar with more of this stuff. Just use this scrap over here though just to have a little bit of balance and I better just go ahead and use this here too. This is so fun and so cute. Okay, I'm gonna put this over here. I need a little bit more something right up there at the top. All right, I just need one slender kind of leaf like this one.
like that and that that just so all the corners are sort of framed I'm going to do this one up here that there. I don't love that note thing. I think I'm going to take that off. And I might, I think I'm going to swap these two, the car and the present, because I want to have a present in the sidebar, a present or two, or maybe just presents falling down, and I don't want this one to be so close to it. So, pick that up and move the car. Okay, so I'm gonna put this here. Okay, let me do some of these presents coming down here. I'm going to use that scrap there. Okay, how about... this present sort of tilted that way. Hmm. Not like it at the top. So let's do Bring in some other little element in there, like some of these little cups or something. Maybe I should do another present peeking it on. Let's do a red one, like this red and green. Okay, I'm gonna go with that for a minute. See, um, hmm, this though, it looks so small. What if I do this one instead? And do this one somewhere else? Okay, let's see. I'm gonna do one of these. It has the pink ribbon. This is a paper sticker, but I think it's cute. I'll trim it like that. I'll just tuck that little scrap there in the corner. Okay, I need to work on boxes now. So let's go with. I 
I don't know. I think I'm going to do like two or three clusters. So I'm going to do that and a pink one. that stacked like that and I'm going to do this bigger red one I think I'll do this one here Let's go back to this green here. I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna move this red one down here. liking it except I want to have uh, something here so I'm gonna do one more pink and one more green all right y'all I was gonna try to work with this but I just can't I'm gonna go ahead and make these into small boxes and it's gonna be super easy to do I'll just have to like cut it cut it in half okay just do this and this. Because it's just all starting to look too much alike. Let's see, I think I want these over here though because I have this for Monday. I could do some bullet points over here, I guess. So I'm going to just piece that together where it's a little bit smaller than what it was. Yes. Okay. And the same with this one. Or you know what? I might take this one and pair it with this and then do a smaller one up here. Okay, that's what I'll do. Hmm. Thinking big in. I think I am gonna move these over here. Cause I'll need a lot of room to write for the week of Christmas. Let's do um, one big green one here, like a square one. This color, I haven't used anything that color yet. So I'm gonna just trim this note section off cause I don't like it. I don't dislike it, but I just like it better without it. All right, I'm gonna make this a bit smaller too. I'm gonna just trim it so it's not, so it's a mid-size. It's not square, but it's not this size, somewhere in between. Like that. what it needed but now let's see 
I think I'm going to scoot this set over where it's not on Saturday and Sunday, but it's on Friday and Saturday, and then do one more box like this up here. So let me see if I can lift this all up at one time. Well, no, I can't do the pink one because it is separate. Okay. Okay, now one more, um, I think I'll do this color green again. So I have this one, but I'm gonna cut it this way because I don't want to use those. Those uh, three circles. Okay. Now I want to do it over here. Okay, cute. Let me lift this up a little bit. You know what? Instead of bullet points, I think I'm going to draw some lines just to sort of break up all the boxiness. So I'm going to do some lines here. Oh, that's cute okay I was worried that I was gonna regret it but so I can just journal in here if I don't have lists to, to do but I like the way it looks and a lot of times when I draw these lines I will come back in and do the boxes but I like to just leave it open in case I don't want to do them okay and here and here some here. Okay, and then I'm also going to have some over here. I don't like those. They're too, it's too evenly balanced with this. I might, I'm gonna cover that up either all the way or with um, part of it with sticker paper. So like I could just leave the bottom set. I don't know, I don't think I like it at all. Okay. All right. Sometimes you just don't know if you're going to like something until you see it. Okay, so I think there, though, I do want to do something. How about just a couple of bullet points? Here and here. Do the pink, I think. OK, 
Okay, it's kind of bothering me that I don't have any bullet points over here, but there's clearly nowhere to put any, so I think it's going to be fine. The only thing I want now is something to go with these, these little boxes, like either words to do, something like that, or little strip quotes. I'm going to go to this because I might be able to use some of those little tiny strip quotes. Okay, like these. Okay, hello winter. I could do that on the, is winter on the 20th or the 21st? Oh, I think those are cute. I think that's what I'm gonna do. So winter is, I, can, I don't know why I can't ever remember, but it is on the 21st, so that's perfect. The 21st is here. They're just subtle and I like them. There's a little bit of gold foil here too. Ooh, I like this one that says Christmas lights down here. I think I'll do Christmas lights on two different ones like this. These are just cute little finishing touches. Okay, so that can go there. And then how about, let's do a little one over here, Believe. Or you know what? I'm gonna do Believe over here. I think I'll do believe here to break, you know, make it a little bit not so even, not so uh, matchy, like all on the top. So let's do Christmas lights over here. I think I'll actually do believe right here on the side. And now some, I want to do some in here too, over here, I mean. Oh, what fun. Let's do it right up here. We'll do, let's do cheers right here on Christmas Eve. I know, we'll do, let's do traditions on this one. And maybe I just want a couple more little, um, you know, little fun elements like these things sprinkled in throughout here very sparingly, of course, because I've got a lot going on, but I'm digging it. I think also before I finish this one out, I'm going to do a few more little leaves like I need something up here mainly. i just do these couple of little leaves right up here. see how it looks. I'm not for sure yet. Oh, I like it. Do the same over here.
apologize if this is turning into a longer video. I can't, won't be able to know for sure until I start editing, but I have been working on it for quite a bit, but I'm really just having so much fun with it. I'm gonna put those little leaves there. Take a quick look at the Christmas book and that is gonna be, the, and that is gonna be it. Maybe add a couple of little things, I don't know. So let's see. Something that I've already used, you know, like a present or something. Or one of those little cups. Oh, I could put that there where it says cheers. That's cute. Okay, I'm going to do something up here. Okay, what about a present here? Not the same as those though. Let's do this one with the pink ribbon that I have not done yet. I'm gonna do one of these little round peppermint candies right here and do the other one over here. And then one more, do a small part of it up here and do some here. Do also one here, so this little set has one. Okay, that's it. I'm not gonna add anything else. Oh, I had the most fun putting this spread together. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you have a super, super duper Merry Christmas and I really enjoyed hanging out with you today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye.